What's down, my people? You're not tuned in to me TV. Now, we're going to bring you all the stories about the stories that we need to bring you stories about. You feel me? So, that's what we're going to do. Some stories might be good. Some story might be tragic. But, hey, man, that's how these stories go. I don't make it up. Nah, we getting into it. You feel me? So, before, look, man, bang the like button. Bang that subscribe button. You see them on the screen. Yeah, them right there. Hit the like and subscribe, man. Hit that right there. Now we about to get started with our story. Yo, 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 man. As you see on the thumbnail, on the title, you feel what I'm saying? This is a crazy one right here. This is a wild, wild story, man. I don't even know where to begin. Yeah, man. So before I even begin, man, hit the like button, hit the subscribe before we go any further. Hit that like button, man. Hit the like button, hit that subscribe on the road to 5K, man. Help me get to 5K, man. 5K subscribers, man. So let's go, man. But yeah, this story right here, I like to say to all my fathers and all my mothers, you feel me? Protect your children, no matter whether it's a man, young man, young woman, right? So, we had this young man right here that you see on the screen, Ivan Eben Williams. So, the wild story is his coach catfished him. Yes, man, his coach catfished him. And... This was like an assistant coach of, or a head of basketball operations, should I say? Yes, man. This guy got catfished on some type of dating sites. Now, I don't know what's the odds of two people just happen to meet on a dating site like this. I don't know what's the odds of that. And I don't know how much work actually goes into actually catfishing someone. Like... He could have catfished any other person in the world, but he chose to catfish this guy that was on the team. Now, that, amongst other things, just don't make no sense. Like, how can it be just so happen the person you catfish is one of your basketball player friends? Let me say, excuse me, one of your basketball players that's on your team. I don't know, man. So, the guy, Ivan Williams, right? The student, the student athlete, right? So, he was catfish, right? So, they was texting back and forth, sending uh, explicit messages, of course, naked pictures or, or, or whatnot. And it was never said if he sent this guy... Uh, the coach, it, it was never specified if he sent any new pictures, but it was definitely specified that the young man, Ivan Williams, sent some new pictures. And from, from that, the coach was trying to blackmail this young man. You feel what I'm saying? Now, I don't know what type of catfish this was or what type of information that he had on this young man to make this young man want to sleep with him. So he ended up catfishing him. Now he got the video. Now he's blackmailing the young man. And he blackmailed him basically saying, if you have sex with me or if you be in a relationship with me, however, however it really goes, in that area, then I won't blackmail you. So I guess the young man finally got tired of it and finally said enough is enough. And he either went to the authorities or he went uh, to the to the courthouse, however, however that situation may go. But now he's filing a lawsuit. Now, the big thing is 
this had gotten back to the head basketball coach, which is Juan Dixon. Juan Dixon is a former NBA player, a former college standout at the University of Maryland. And for the last five, maybe six seasons, he's been a coach of Coppin State. And just to mention, Coppin State has a horrible record every year he's been there. Every year he's been there, he hasn't did anything with the program at all. Not lifted up to uh, major heights or anything like that. But now we have this this coach, right? And this coach is a predator. This coach is a predator. Like how many kids, how many young men have you done this to before? Where did you get this idea from? How can you how can you do this so easy with a with a with a good conscience? How can you prey on people's kids, man? Like how can you how can you do this without having no remorse? Uh, uh, how can you stomach this? Like this is a wild story. This is a wild story, man. So now you got Juan Dixon, the head coach, is caught in the middle of a scandal between the player and the coach. And as far as my knowledge, I think he either got fired or resigned, man. But let me know. What you think about this story? This is a wild, wild story, man. A very, very ill, ill story, man. Protect your kids, man. You got to arm your kids with knowledge, man. And this is what I want to say once again. I don't know how much of coincidence it is that you got what information do you have on a person that you could blackmail them to make them sleep with you? Male on male contact. My thing is, my thing is, from what I'm thinking, whether it's true or not true, this guy probably already had male on male contact. It probably wasn't as how we see it. And that's all I'm going to say. But man, you like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you think about this wild, wild story in the comments. Me personally, I don't like it, but I definitely have a bunch of uh, questions that would need to be answered for me to feel comfortable with this. But yeah, man, let me know what y'all think in the comments, man, because I'll be back with another one.